Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Ethan Brown and I am an amateur math magician. Now a math magician is someone who combines math and magic and amateur is someone who does not get paid. <laughs> now Mrs. Quader, a fourth grade math teacher, has graciously volunteered to help me out today. So Mrs. Quader, please come on up to the overhead projector, pick up the pencil. Now, we will start off by squaring a couple of numbers. As most of you know, squaring a number is multiplying it by itself. So four squared is? 16. 16. Exactly. Now to make this a little more difficult, we will be squaring a two-digit number. So when someone gives us a two-digit number, you're gonna multiply that number times itself, and remember to show all of your work. So can someone please give us a two-digit number? Someone from Raise your hands. Someone for a two-digit number, raise your hands. Okay, a two-digit number? 85. Multiply 85 times 85, make sure you get 7,225, otherwise you did something wrong. 7,225. Okay, if you have a calculator, you can check it, 7,225. You have a calculator? Is it, is it right? Good? Okay. Now, you might want to use the calculator for the next one. <laughs> and to make this even more interesting, we're going to make this into a race. So, Mrs. Quader, you're going to do the problem on the calculator and then write it down and I will try to call out the answer before you finish writing it down. And to make this even more interesting, you're gonna give us a really difficult two-digit number. So can someone from the audience again give us a really difficult two-digit number? 98. You? 98 squared, 98. go. 9,604, did I beat you? <laughs> So for the next part of the act, I've given Ms. Shulkin, you can come out now, a book of calendars. It goes from 1901. The book of calendars goes from 1901 to 2100. And I have one last question for the audience. By a show of hands, does anyone know the day of the week they were born on? Like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, the day of the week they were born on. Monday. Now, <laughs> you're not supposed to say it. No one say it, just keep your hands up. Now, please put your hands down if you are too embarrassed to tell us all the year you were born in. <laughs> okay, put your hands back up again if you're good. So, Ms. Shokin, they're going to give us the year, that's what you'll give us first, then the month, then the, then the date, the number. You're going to, I'm going to say the day of the week it was, Ms. Shokin, you'll confirm. So, you have someone, Mrs. Carpenter, what year was it? 1964. 1964, put to the calendar, 1964 as a month? October. October what? 31st. 31st. Would that be a Saturday? Yes? Okay, now, now someone else, the day of the week they were born on, someone else. What year was it? 2003. 2003? Okay, and what month? November. November what? 12. 12? Well, would that be a Wednesday? Yes. Yes? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, Ms. Shoki, while you have that book of calendars, look to any year in the future. So from 2010 to 2100. What year did you choose? 2056. 2056. 
Now flip to any, choose any month, any date. What month did you choose? May. May what? Third. Third. Will that be a Wednesday? Yes. And it, and it will be cloudy. Yes.